So, you graduated college and you feel immensely overwhelmed when you think about your next steps. Like many other grads, they feel the same anxiety swelling up. After college, it's really important to consider building onto the foundation college has offered you by taking charge of your development and enhancing your marketability to prospective employers when entering a new career field. The Fast Start team aims to guide new grads to build the skills that succeed and consciously pursue the actions that accelerate. Today, we encourage you to consider developing skills that will set yourself apart from the pack. Faith, our team would love to congratulate you on your graduation and state that we're so thrilled to work with you. Our specific mission today is to offer you a specific, measurable, achievable, relevant, and timely goal that will serve as one of your first destinations on your new career journey. After our time together, our goal is for you to feel ready to take the right next steps to begin your career journey, ones that will create lasting and long-term positive outcomes. Equipping you with a clear roadmap of the next steps following graduation, the team at Fast Starter wants to get you excited about what is to come next. Let's take a brief overview of today's activities with our time together. We will begin with giving you a position recommendation, and then we will follow with proposing a goal. Um, we will then talk about what exactly is on the line. We'll follow up with some logistics. We'll kind of close off with a big picture, and then we'll offer some closing notes and talk a little bit about the value of a growth mindset. The starting position recommendation we have for you today is one of a project manager. Generally, the median salary for project managers is around $77,000 a year. Um, assuming inflation rates, periodic raises every about five years, and a general career span of nearly 45 years, we have created a chart through Excel um, to really highlight the difference between the median salary and the 90th 90th percentile salary as you move um, throughout the years of your career and whenever we review the data you'll be able to see that the difference widens um, across the length of the chart and um, the difference just grows larger and larger in the earnings as you go so looking at what we can do to get in that 90th percentile is um, very important and we'll kind of talk about this as we move forward so covering moving into the 90th percentile throughout the span of our career, um, the proposal of a goal um, is specifically kind of leading us straight out of college into our career field is for um, you, Faith, to obtain the Microsoft 365 Fundamentals Certification. Um, project management generally requires fluency in most Microsoft applications with a strong focus in Excel as it's used to track project milestones, create Gantt charts, and analyze project data. Um, it can also be utilized as a tool to help you manage project budgets, create project timelines, and overall just work with project plans in an organized space. Um, this certification can offer you a competitive edge beyond the scope of what college has had to offer. And as we know, technology is rapidly evolving in business and fluency in technology is vital for you to be able to adapt in the new um, and rapidly evolving workspace. So validating your knowledge of Microsoft 365 um, and those platforms will make it clear for your future employers and the organizations you work for to understand um, that you know the basics of the software and you understand the value of implementing them into preparing your projects whenever you're serving in the role of a project manager. So in the context of your career and development, monetary returns um, are obviously a huge deal. Um, why is this important to you? Well, 35% of Microsoft certified employees reported wage and salary increases. Um, through gaining extra marketable skills, they also gained a competitive edge. Um, whenever we really start looking at the benefits of working towards earning this certification, it will allow any new grad to set themselves apart and experience overall less struggle when utilizing the software um, platforms on the job. Generally, the new grads who obtain the certification 
will have greater familiarity with applications and platforms, and this can potentially lead to lower levels of stress when entering a new position straight out of college, because that can be nerve wracking to begin with. So here's that chart um, when I was talking about the difference in that median salary and the 90th percentile salary for project managers. Um, you have a potential of increased wealth over the working lifetime um, in current dollars. And the difference in starting salary um, can even just further emphasize the value of building the skills that succeed and consciously pursuing those actions that accelerate um, here what we say at Fast Starter um, and the value they can have uh, an attribution to your career. Um, so if we take a look at this chart, if you begin with a median salary as a new grad and work consistently to acquire new skill sets um, to accelerate your career, you can work your way up um, to being an employee in the 90th percentile. And you can see those earnings just get that that gap widens to where it's like if you are in that 90th percentile, you really start to take off in your annual wages. Um, so let's say this takes you all 45 years working up to retirement. You will have made um, in your lifetime as a project manager starting after college um, roughly a calculated $1,581,975 rather than not reaching the millions um, and having only earned $991,052 if you wouldn't have made the investment into yourself. Um, and developed those skill sets. So staying in the median salary earning um, earnings bracket for your career can cost you um, money in the long run. Um, so I just think that chart offers a lot of insight to why we should prioritize getting these skills um, under our belt and getting just more diverse in what we can offer as we start interviewing with these prospect employers. So looking at the logistics, this goal is measurable. Um, it's measured by passing the exam, having acquired adequate knowledge of Microsoft 365 applications, um, qualifying you to obtain your certificate uh, for the course and being able to use this um, and market yourself to um, employers in the future. This goal is certainly achievable. Um, this program and certification offers self-paced content and offers available instructor-led training events. Um, and there's also practice exams you can start engaging with about midway through the certification process. There's also the convenience of online registration and online learning content. This goal is also relevant. Um, this certification can offer you a competitive edge beyond the scope of what college has had to offer. Um, as we know, tech is rapidly evolving in business and fluency in these new platforms and software is, is just essential to survive in the workplace. Um, so it's definitely very relevant and will give you an upper edge on your daily um, responsibilities when interacting with the software. So what we're always looking at um, is obviously the amount of time this is gonna take, right? Time is one of the most valuable things we have. And really with this goal, we can complete the self-paced certification within two months. Um, if you began the task at the end of May following graduation and wrapped up at the end of summer in July of 2024, this is when a lot of new grads have taken their break, rewarded themselves with a little bit of summer and they begin applying for jobs. So this allows summer for um, you to kind of serve as a rest period so you could apply yourselves also to grow your mindset, your skill set, and build upon the foundation that you have actively been building um, throughout your time in college when it comes to your understanding of business processes, programs, and just getting ready and prepared to be um, an employee working for a prospective employer. Okay, so what we're really looking at here and what I really want to emphasize in this presentation is um, earning potential and how consciously making the choice to um, develop your skills and take the actions that accelerate your career, you know, making that investment and in developing yourself um, can really affect the amount of money you earn during your professional um, lifetime before you end up retiring. 
So what we're looking at here is a schedule of milestones and kind of what we would be looking at for that two month period over the summer following graduation to get the certification under your belt. Um, so you can take a look at this and it really gives you about two full months between registering for the exam and then taking the actual exam um, and acquiring that certification certificate on July 30th. So we're looking good there. And then kind of as we move towards the end of this presentation, again, we really want to emphasize um, and look at um, really the amount of lifetime wealth that's on the line for people who um, are looking at either being kind of passive and just working their way through their career with the skill set that they have acquired um, and knowledge through college or um, whether they are being very purposeful to take the steps to um, accelerate their career. So analyzing the spreadsheet our team created um, in regard to your age being 22 and recommending the position in project management, we can definitely conclude that staying in the median salary earning bracket for your career can cost you nearly at the end $591,000 in earning potential at the close of your career when you retire after about 45 years at the age of 67. That is a little insane to comprehend. So we're really looking at the benefits here of making more money, um, building confidence, feeling more content with your job, feeling less stress, feeling like you can do it. You know um, how to work with Microsoft 365 platforms and utilize them well and effectively in your project management um, duties every day at work. Um, so here's kind of some statistics about what people said and felt about obtaining their certifications. Um, we really just want to grow a solid foundation outside of college uh, that allows us to build more skills to use in the workplace and stand out when it comes to interviewing. So as we conclude our time together, we really just want to talk about the importance and highlight the, um, the urgency to strategize and prioritize self-development um, so that you can grow to reach new heights as you begin your professional career and throughout the duration of um, your working career in general. Um, so here we can look at some present uh, adjectives compared to future somebody like maybe me at the beginning of my career before I worked for Fast Starter I was rather anxious with some of these platforms and working with them utilizing them properly um, and this certification taking the time to get it will allow you to grow confident in that area um, this will allow your basic knowledge to expand um, in general when it comes to that foundational understanding of how to use this software um, whenever it comes to project planning. You can also go from being just a general position applicant to one of the top contenders because what we're talking about here is setting yourself apart and giving yourself a competitive edge just as you begin. Again, this is that step one, that first destination in a um, commitment to career long dedication to strategizing um, your development. And, and really you can, if you do that, you will grow from an average earner over time, even if it takes all 45 years to that top percentile earner up in that 90%. And again, we won't be missing out on that large amount of earning potential um, if in the case, like if we would have never taken the time to invest in our development. So I hope you really take these considerations and are able to apply yourself over the summer and get started in your career with a strong start and a fast start. So we appreciate your time.